So it is Monday here at the Woofer Walkers. It's Monday everywhere, actually. Well, in this side of the world. Um, we are the Woofer Walkers Doggy Services out of Richmond, British Columbia, Canada. And um, we are at the Woofer Walkers Doggy Daycare Resort and Sanctuary. I'm Woofer Walker Jezebel. That's Woofer Watcher Han Hannah. No, Jamie, sorry. And these are just some of the woofers that we are watching right now. Um, for our regular viewers, you might notice that uh, the woofer... This big shepherd here, Echo, is back. Um, for our new viewers, the reason why Echo has a muzzle on is because she was not socialized um, very much with other dogs, other woofers, pardon me, um, for most of her years, and she's seven years old now. So, um, what we, ha we have taken on we have taken on the wonderful job of trying to get her used to being around other woofers and becoming a social butterfly. And to be honest with you, she's not doing a bad job today, but it was a little rough in the beginning, which is why we're really glad that we have these tools like the muzzle. I just want to let everybody know, just to show you something so you don't get all upset. Um, can you just hold her for a second? I wanna show people the, this muzzle. So this muzzle, you can see she can pant, she can drink water, she can open her mouth, she can bark, she can do whatever she wants, um, except for bite, <laughs> which is the whole point. We don't want her to, you can't, please don't use those ones that close their mouth when you're going to have a muzzle on for extended period of time because dogs actually need to sweat through their mouth when they're running around. And those little muzzles that you use just for temporary things like nail clipping or a quick look from the vet or something, those ones don't let them pant. You want them to be able to pant and drink water and all of that stuff when, they're, when they have to wear one for quite a long time, for an extended period of time. I'm really, really, really proud of her. At this point, I mean, honestly, like, she's doing so well. I mean, when she first came out, she was nervous and she did a few... Uh, well, I'm not going to put it too politely. She did attack some dogs, but that was because they were invading her space and she's not used to that. She had a muzzle on. She didn't hurt anybody. Don't worry. She cannot hurt anybody with the muzzle on. But as as the more exposure that, she, exposure that she's been getting throughout the day here and the longer she's been out, um, the more she's realizing, you know, these dogs are not here to, to hurt her. And uh, so she hasn't felt the need to um to lash out or, or to lunge or anything she's just actually starting to learn how to play again like she did last time when she was here uh she does have a very strong prey drive which is normal for german shepherd she has an extremely high prey drive but she's just extra shepherd what can you do she she was a farm dog so i'm not surprised <laughs> she, she probably chased uh who knows probably squirrels and all kinds of things out of the yard so she just she's just learning just learning that you know, she's not in danger. There's no reason to lunge at anybody. She's great with people, by the way. It's not a people problem. Oh, Chance! No digging! No! Chancey! Good boy! Chance, what are you doing? You're not, you wouldn't be eating dirt, would you? Not me. Nope, not me. Not eating any dirt. So this is Chance. It's his first day of vacation with us um he's never been on vacation with us before he is a chocolate lab and shepherd mix we looked it up um and that's why he's got this beautiful color kind of matches the rest of the ground actually <laughs> nice chocolate color and um yeah he's he's a wonderful guy he's a little shy he was a little shy when he first got here he was doing a lot of um, sweating, foaming at the mouth because he was stressed, but wasn't so stressed that he didn't want to, you know, that he, he didn't hang out the, at the gate or try to escape. And as you can see now, his tail is up. He's all Mr. Casual. He's not trying to get away. He's not hiding. And you can also see that he's, extre oh, he's extremely handsome. He's extremely <laughs> handsome. <laughs> And I also noticed that he has some black spots on his tongue, some purpley black spots, which make me think there's got to be something more than Chocolate Lab and Shepherd in there. Some, there's got to be something else, 
Something with the purple tongues. Pretty cool. But he's handsome. We're so glad to have him. He's going to be with us for, I think, 28-day vacation. So certainly he's going to be uh, completely used to being here and just one of the gang, one of the pack by the time. Oh, God, probably after like a couple of days even. <laughs> Pretty sure. He just has to get used to being inside and staying overnight. We'll find him a nice spot. He can sleep upstairs if he likes, outside, the, outside of the main bedroom where we keep the littles. Or he can pick one of the bedrooms if he wants to have one to himself. Here's Mosiah. Mosiah's back today. He's been away for a while. He's a black shepherd. Been an extremely good boy. We're so happy that he's back. We've missed him. We've missed him so much. Here's good old Scout. Scout the blue healer and, and uh, Border Collie. Doing what Scout does best. Looking at the ball and staring at it. Surprised he's not yelling at us to throw it, to be honest. <laughs> What's the, all this then? That better be friendly play. He's like, I don't, I don't want to play with you. You're, <laughs> you're weird. Maybe don't pick on the new guy. <laughs> he just got here. He wants to enjoy his vacay. He wants to enjoy his vacay. Yeah. There we go. Come on. Good girl. Leave him be. Scouty, what do you got? So let's go see who's up on the deck, shall we? Let's go see if the... Oh, there's another ball. Whee! Who's up here? Oh, it's Haruka and AC. And Kuma. Are you guys playing Ring Around the Rosie up here? Playing hide and seek? Haruka. Haruka is a Sammy. A Samoid. Samoid. Tomato, tomato. Potato, potato. <laughs> and AC is a chocolate lab on the right. And Kuma is the shepherdy kind of Malinois looking thing. Beautiful girl. Beautiful leggy girl. Hi. Hello. Come on, Echo. Hi. I'm so proud of you. You're doing so well, baby girl. Hi, AC. AC, little chocolate lab baby. Haruka, don't, oh, for our new viewers, I just want to let you know, all of these woofers, every single one of them, is going to be clean before they go home. We always make sure everybody gets a nice, warm bath and a really good towel dry. And Haruka gets, she gets, she gets a blow dry too, because she's, we just, we want her to look extra special when she goes home, because she's white. White and floofy. Look at those girls. Look at that echo. What a good girl. What a bunch of good kids we got. What a bunch of good kids we got. You look pretty happy, Echo, I gotta say. You look pretty happy. Are you happy? You like dogs, don't you? Kuma's like, eek. Haruka. Oh, Haruka, you're so silly. <laughs> Hi, ladies. Hi. And also, I should mention for our newest, newer viewers, we don't just have big woofers. We have a whole separate thing going on on the other side uh, where we have teeny tiny, teeny tiny toy woofers in the VIP, very important petites room. We've got some medium woofers and we have some other big woofers over there that just don't, don't really enjoy being around these high energy big breed woofers. That they prefer the company of the more gentle breeds. Like Lolo, for instance. Lolo is a senior golden retriever. He has no interest in playing rough with these guys. He does come back here, but he spends his entire time sitting with his ball. And he just went on a on a munch or sorry, a woofer walk, which is one of our off leash off leash pack walks. So woof, he's and he's like 16 years old, so he's he's done. He's over there. Are you doing so well? 
so proud of you. Good girl, Echo. Good girl. And Mosiah, I'm so proud of you. Thank you for being so good. Chaz, I'm so proud of you. You're such a brave boy. We're going to have such a nice time here. <laughs> were you just, were you playing? Oh no, I thought he was playing. I actually thought Scout was playing with a dog for a minute, but he's just protecting the ball, I think. <laughs> Scouty! <laughs> you're a monkey. Wasaya, you're a monkey. Step on it, step on it. Oh. He's, he knows what you're up to. It's like, you're not getting my ball. How can we throw the ball for you if you just keep running away with it, though? <laughs> yeah, he's a monkey. Oh, Haruka has one. Haruka, where'd you get that? Where'd you get that? <laughs> Look at the beautiful sunshine we have in December. Blue sky. Just gorgeous. We had so much fog today, and now it's just totally cleared up. It's a gorgeous day. Anyways, happy Monday.